Okay. <laughs> Wait, if he jumps up, then we're done. We're, no, it's done. We're it's like a, it's a, oh. <laughs> <laughs> please, please, no, Jelly Bay, no! Guys, if you're anything like us and you collect Pokemon cards, that means you have a ton of duds. And by duds, I mean, bro, what are the ones that are keepers? Bees, EXs. Bees, EXs. Basically, if it's not a cool card, it goes into boxes like these, and we have 10 trillion of them. And today, we are going to see how big of a house of cards we can build with our Pokemon things. That's our challenge. I am in shock at just how many cards you have. Whoa, you got a lot of doubles. Dude, you have so many cards. Yeah. You have a lot of really pretty cards. Okay, I'm getting distracted. Sorry guys, let's just, house of cards. This is going to be awesome. We're almost attached. Oh, we're almost attached, guys. Babes' station is almost connected to mine. Oh, my ceiling is the best part. It's easy. It's just so stable. Bro, look at that. Bro. <laughs> well, you're technically like da, 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 da. Just add a roof out there or at another connection point. Look at, look, I already work connected, bro. Look at this. Let's go. No, Bims! No! Rest in peace to that one random guard. Oh, Bims, this is looking really good. I would say so far we have spread out maybe over two feet of an area and it is awesome already we're just getting started so i don't really have a plan i'm just going through and i'm leaning what i can i'm not going to worry about a ceiling just yet or a floor depending on how you look at it that will come later and another one and another one and one over here also one here and here I'm gonna see this Pokemon logo in my sleep. It's just, they're everywhere on every single card. After a while, you start to get pretty fast at it. Just boop, 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 boop. Okay. Wait, if he jumps up, then we're done. We're, no, it's done. We're it's like doomed. a, it's a, oh. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, please, no, Jelly Bay, no. no. Oh, I can't handle it, bro. You gotta get down. I'm so sorry. <laughs> He's spooked. He's like, guys, I don't know what's going on with the pool table. Bro, are you luring me to the treats? Is that why you went down there, bro? Bro, this is starting to look so cool already. Look yeah. at that. I think it might be time to start the roof. Whoa, energy card. You know what? I am gonna put that there. I don't know if I should be like super organized and like grid-like or if I should just kind of spam them everywhere like this. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. What would look cooler? I, I do not know. Also, also cost more cards though. Yeah, that's true. Also, here's another question for you, my guy. Hmm. Interesting side up or do I put the Pokemon side up? Anyway, it would look cooler with the both of them. Like, just chaotic like, everywhere? Yeah, chaotic everywhere. All right, let's start roofing. All right, the first floor is finished. Now, this is a perfect time for me to show you how I start these stacks. I was looking on YouTube for the best way to start at House of Cards, and I came across this one YouTuber. His stuff is amazing. He's like the guy for House of Cards, and I'll show you his method for starting it. It works. What you do is you take one hand, you take one card, and you just hold it there vertical like this and you, and you don't move right that that's the start and then you lean one card you lean a third card and then oh no Here i should have grabbed another babes oh, no. oh, come to my rescue one. one card please thank you sir and once you get that fourth card leaned in you can take your initial card that you started with and you can slowly let go and the end shape should be like a square like and after that, like the, sun. like the sun, dude. And after that, it's like pretty solid. Mm -hmm. After that, you just start leaning as the whole thing just goes. Doo -doo 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 -doo. <laughs> Woo! -hoo -hoo. Ooh, this is not stable yet. Whoa! The second story is scary. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think we're stabilized. The more cards I add, seem to be more stable. So. That's good. The second row is so much comically harder than the first one. How many times has it completely crumbled, bro? Like three? Yeah, I've had to start over from scratch three times now. I just like, just barely look at it and it just goes <laughs> <laughs> Thankfully, the strong first base is also flat. Doesn't fall apart because that thing is sturdy. Yeah, it's like super, super reliable. Dude, this is hard. 
Okay, this thing has fallen another like five times. It's crazy. Can we actually start a third row right now? I'm going to say no, but I have to at least try because as impressive as it is to have a two fur, a three fur would be really, really you, dope. Let's see. You probably, oh, you have four cards. I got four. That's one, two, three, four. Lean them back away. Grab more cards. Hurry up and stabilize before it has time to realize just how unstable it all is. Okay. Okay, okay. You know what? I want to put one roof on just for stability. No! Yeah. Hi, Mimi. Hi, Mimi. Mimi, I love you, baby. I don't know if it's good to come up right now. Uh. She most likely does want to go home. <laughs> so, guys. No! No! So, what? Uh, <laughs> oh, my God. Uh, this just happened off camera. Babes, welcome. <laughs> welcome to the show, bud. It's incredibly tricky. <laughs> so that YouTuber that I was just telling you guys about, he makes it look effortless. It's not effortless. There's a lot of effort. It's effortful. It's effortful. Is that a word? Uh, no. I'm just gonna leave the camera running just because obvious reasons. Because once it goes, it's like pretty instant. You like blink and it's flat. No, no. don't fall. fall. Please, Please. Don't. I just, uh, No, don't fall. Woo! Look at this thing. It actually looks really impressive. There's a, quite a lot of cards. Bibs, you're doing great. That's how it starts, man. Before you get too, too far, why don't you put two or three ceiling bits on top? Because I've realized that that kind of stabilizes everything a little bit. Now guys, the reason why I've kind of left it like kind of funky shaped is because I think I want to build a track around it. Yeah, I think that would be awesome. I don't know if it's as secure as I think it might be in order to get pieces on top of it, but that will be fun to try. Should I stop now? Yes. Will you? No. I want to do one more uh, level. This pocket is my enemy. The enemy. I saw that. I managed to keep the explosion away. Let's go. It's good. Yeah. And I just got my third, fourth row going. <laughs> Feeling real good. How you can't really drop it. You have to peacefully lay it. Yeah. Or else this bye bye to your whole thing. It's like you're going to do it peacefully. Bye bye. Yes. Either it's getting more stable as more cards are being added or I'm getting better at it. I think that I might just be getting better at it. Ooh, good job, babes. Woo! Since we're out of cards, we'll go get another one. All right, babes, we're gonna go grab more cards because we're shockingly out. So guys, if you collect Pokemon cards like us, you likely have a stash of, of commons as well. And I challenge you, see how big of a house of cards you can make before it comes crashing down. It is deceivingly hard. Look at this, we have more. Like, we have more. I have more. like 10 more boxes in my room. <laughs> it's ridiculous. All right, bro. Let's let's get started, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. We're out. Bye. -bye.